Oh, it'll be a different, different looking midfield without Andrew. We've we've had him for so long. There's a really good sense of unity amongst our players. So that's been there from start of pre-season. I think the spirit's been really strong. I think it's one of some games this year. So. I can't see why that wouldn't change. Port have been playing some reasonable football this year. Yeah, they've lost a couple, but they're always tough, especially over there. So it'll be a good challenge and we'll need to be up for it. Uh, heading into finals, we're going to stay true to our system and know that when guys come in, they play their role within our systems. We want top four, you know, we want to crack at that. So, and preferably top two. So for us to do that, we need to knock over Port. West Coast, they can go a long way to getting those home finals in September if they win here today. Hutchings enters it back to Yo. He's a powerful kick. Wow. And what a strike it was. Elliot Yo. Punching handball through is good from Shui to Archie. Can Ryan do his thing inside 50? He's taken the mark. Will he take the shot or give to Cripps? He went to the more experienced Cripps, who was able to fumble, oh. wait, and then get it all together when it mattered. What a goal! Just what Ken Hinckley didn't want, but the Eagles have been able to scrap together a couple of goals in the quarter. Shuey slipped through the tackle, Redden plays the percentages, although the odds are against Vardy. Went crashing to the ground, Archie, and Cripps is the man again on the line. Motlop feeling the searing heat. Archie stepped out. Cripps, the give to Sheed. The strike looks promising. It hits the mark, and they're coming again. Surrounded up by Barris. Back where the numbers are. Ryan! Oh. He was born to fly! What a mark! 16 points right now. A stutter step, but a flowing kick. And they're back to within 10, and the bad memories might be returning for Port. Can they get it clear? Yo, they can. Lies set. High ball is deep. McGavin! History is about to repeat itself again, or is it? The man that takes marks to stop teams has taken a mark to start. The siren sounds. It's a big week for the club, you know, to, to lose Andrew uh, like we did. And it was a six-day break, so part of me thought it was good to get away, but, but we didn't start too well tonight. I thought Port played a really strong, tough brand, and obvious uh, situations with Port with their injuries. There was a bit going on with those key position players. We did our best to expose that, and they did their best to nullify it, so that's why you saw the last quarter, and fortunate enough to get that mark and Gov kick that goal. It just, um, yeah, it was really great for our spirit and our club. It's The last time Shuey shot off the siren, I was actually watching in the crowd, so it was good to uh, be on the field this time. And yeah, I think I got a handball from Yoey in the centre, um, slammed on the boot. I think it was a torpedo to go. I was making sure I was around about where he was kicking it so I could get around him because I knew he was going to kick it. I had to send it back to do a forwards job and um, I guess I didn't hit. Uh, she didn't come off the, uh, the agate too, much, too well, but uh, I was uh, just worrying about aiming at that uh, right hand goalpost and she ended up going him.